Let's examine problem 1, 2b. This has us uh, looking at the typical broad duties of managers. And most intro managerial accounting textbooks define those as strategy formulation, planning, directing, and controlling. So at the very top, we have a broad strategic direction. What are we doing broadly? Planning is, okay, we're going to make a map of where we're going. Uh, you know, okay, here's the map of where we're going. Directing is you're doing your best to follow that map, right? You're saying, okay, here's, we're trying to go in north and, and I'm going to direct us <laughs> northward, northward. Controlling is after, you know, some amount of time, you look back and you say, I was supposed to be going due north. Am I going due north? You're sort of double checking on your plan. You're saying, does my plan still make sense? And am I following it? If so. So that's the, uh, four broad activities. Let's see if we can categorize them here. The following are activities that a manager may perform. Which categories do e does each activity best fit? Strategy formulation, we'll abbreviate as SF, planning P, implementation I, and control C. Uh, and it notes there is one of each in this solution. So if we use planning, we're only going to use it once, right? We're not going to use it multiple times here. Uh, okay. A, Wiz Toilets overspent its first year budget by $50,000 and had to let go of four part-time employees. Ooh, that doesn't sound very good. And just thinking out loud here, by the way, I'm, I'm penciling in in my mind control here. This feels like a control activity because it's looking backwards. We've sort of been working, we overspent a budget, and now we're looking back and we're, we're adjusting because of, we've let go of four people because of it. Um, Wiz Toilets determined the required staffing level and capital expenses required to open the, re the new retail store. Okay, so there's some story about a store being opened here. This is obviously not strategy, right? The, the first line of the story, it would be something different. This, is, uh, this to me sounds like planning, right? We're budgeting or planning ahead. Uh, Wiz Toilets hired two full-time employees and 10 part-timers and rented a small retail space in Shinjuku. Uh, and D, Wiz Toilets decided to enter the Asian market by opening a retail location in Tokyo. Okay, this is almost like put the story in order, like one of those like kids things you might do as you're learning to read. You know, you got to put the pieces of a story in order and strategy formulation is going to come first. So Wiz Toilets decided to enter the Asian market by opening a retail location in Tokyo. And uh, Shinjuku is a, a neighborhood in Tokyo, so that'll come next. But um, uh, I would say this is the broad strategy. We're going to Japan. We're going to enter Tokyo. Uh, I do think that we were correct to say that this would be control. This uh, Wiz Toilets overspend its first year budget by $50,000 and let go of four people. You know, they made a plan. They're looking back to see how well they followed their plan. Obviously, they were a little bit off course there. Okay. Uh Looking at B, Wiz Toilets determined the required staffing level and capital expenses required to open the new retail store. That sounds like planning to me, right? They're making a plan. We think we're going to need 10 employees. We think we're going to need to spend whatever $50,000 to renovate this leased space, whatever the number is. Uh, this to me sounds like planning and, and by process of elimination, the other one's implementation, but let's see if that makes sense. Wiz Toilets hired two full-time employees and 10 part-timers and rented a small retail space in Shinjuku. Yeah, so the plan leads into the implementation. We plan to staff up and we figured what we'd spend on our new retail store. Well, here we are staffing up and uh, renting retail space. So we're implementing the plan. Okay, so there we are. Uh, hopefully this video has been clear to you and I look forward to seeing you in the next video. Bye for now.